This week on Trekkie with the Tractors, will he fit in any of the rides? Stay tuned to find out. Hey, we are in northern Idaho uh, at a small town called Athol, Idaho, which has the largest theme park in the area called Silverwood. Now, we're here because both Bree and I are teachers, uh, and this weekend we can get in for free, which is like $120 savings or something like that. Uh, and, of course, we're here with all three of our kids. You can hear Berkeley in the background. But we're here not just because we're going to get in free, but there's also another reason why today was perfect, right? Yeah, we were just thinking about it, and um, we weren't sure if we were going to be able to take Berkeley here this summer just because um, heat is a big trigger for her seizures, mm -hmm. and it tends to be really hot here in the summer. So yeah, the uh, weather today is perfect. It's rainy and... It's cool. It's it's about 64 degrees, I think, and tomorrow is going to actually be thunderstorms, which they'll close down the park if that happens. But today's supposed to be just kind of a steady rain, and like Bree said, we, we don't get to take her out to many places because we have to be really hyper aware of that with extreme heat. Cold doesn't bother her as much. We... We're going to try and enjoy it. We're going to go through the rain. We have all of our rain gear. And uh, it's the first time with everybody in the family and no help uh, going through a theme park. So we'll see how it goes. They got a quick 30-minute nap, the two girls. So hopefully rides, candy, and whatever else we can do to make this fun. Yeah, it's already late afternoon. I mean, it's going to be a quick trip. It's not going to be like a whole day thing. No, so no. just... A little fun experience. We we really try to not limit let her um, Dravet syndrome limit what we do as a family, but really it does. We have to be careful what we do um, mm -hmm. and what what the conditions are like. So yeah, just figuring out what makes it work. You know, that's adapting, and we're gonna jet out of here and see how this works. You have some fun. All right. So this is our rain set up sprinkling a little bit but they seem to be having a good time so far we're gonna have fun Sawyer yeah what do you think Bert okay. having fun yet there she goes. Are you wanting anything you want, okay? Not here, you don't have to pick here. Do you think you might want one of those? All right, well, let's walk around a little bit more. If you choose to get that, we'll come back. Okay? This is pretty nerve wracking. Yeah. 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 Swing, Berkeley. Five. And then how many? Oh, we got two. It's all about the rides. <laughs> it's 
Say hi, Mama. Are you excited? Hi. My first time on the big swing. <laughs> How you liking the rain there, kid? <laughs> we having fun? Yeah, I was really nervous. Uh huh. That first ride with Berkeley. You and me both. <laughs> He's having fun. Sawyer Burke. Burke Burke, hi. So this time at Silverwood, we pretty much just stayed in the kitty area. Um, it worked out really well for us. Um, the girls were just the right sizes to ride on all the rides um, and they did great going on a bunch of the rides all by themselves. I was so proud of Berkeley and Sawyer both. They were so brave. Push it, Sawyer. <laughs> Push it hard. Push it in hard. Push that one. There you go. Hold it down. Yeah. Hey, there's an owl over there, Bird. Oh my gosh, let's go see the owl. Ready, Sawyer? Go. Hey. It was really nice to just focus on the kids and be in the, the little kid area. Um, it was a nice time to be able to do it since we got in free. So we weren't as worried about like making sure we got our money's worth. We were just able to have fun, let the kids have fun. And it was a really great day. These play places are not made for people my size. Not at all. Uh, okay. I get stuck down there. Uh, such a squeeze. Question is, how do we get her out now? <laughs> candy. <laughs> candy? Burke, you want some candy? Come here. That's not working. You go ride the roller coaster. We'll go ride on the roller coaster, kid. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Here, I'm gonna put this over there then. I'm ready. All right. How do we get over there? I think we go over here. Come on, let's go. Uh, go around. <laughs> Look at that one. You never want to go on that one? No. I never want to go on that one either. I want to go on the kids' one. Okay. That it's is a so kids' one. It's fun and that it warms my heart. All right, let's see. Is there anybody over here? Uh, there's one person over here. Let's try to get on. So Daddy was too big. Legs are too long. Ready to go? You got the whole thing to yourself. All right, you got to put your hands up in the air. Remember roller coaster? Put your hands up in the air. Roller coaster, do it. Do it. Roller coaster! 
She's got the whole train to herself. Another thing that's really nice about going on a day when it's rainy or cool um, is there was not that many people there. It was not very busy. There were not very long lines to get on the rides, so it just worked out perfectly. Such a nice day. Whoa, you're flying! You're flying! <laughs> the first kitty ride I can fit on. Let's see how high we can ride Dumbo. <laughs> what do you think, Burke? Oh, here's mom. Let me get. Whoa. Should we go fly? Here we go. I don't think we're going to get that high. <laughs> what do you think, Burke? Oh my gosh, that's pretty hot. So here. Whoa. It's like a tiniest lawnmower you could imagine. It was about as great as it was to drive up here for an hour and a half. I wanted Sawyer to drive, but she's actually too small to go alone. All right, the last ride is the first ride. Mark's excited. So are you excited? Last ride of the day, and then we're going home. Good day. She'd probably go all day, I think. <laughs> Still want to do a camping trip here. What do you think, Sawyer? Hey, turn around, show me. <laughs> you even got the attitude of a teenager now that she's got a hoodie on. Must come with the hoodie. I guess. <laughs> While we were there, we did notice a bunch of school field trips that were there. Um, there were a bunch of choir and band students from different junior highs, high schools, and this happened on our way out through the tunnel, and it was really an emotional experience. These kids were just singing as we walked through the tunnel, and it was amazing. They did a really great job. It was a very nice end to a very nice day.
right, so we're ending where we began in the parking lot. <laughs> <laughs> we're like the last people here because we had so much to pack up and pack up, nursing, changing kids' clothes because it was wet and rainy all day. And at one point, it was almost like taking a shower, like the rain was that fine. Um, and it was just warm enough, it was still cool, it was just warm enough where I was walking around in my t shirt. I liked it. What about you? Yeah, it was good. It was a good day. Yeah. It was fun. We did good with three kids and infant. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> they all did really well. Burke really liked one ride, like a frog hopper ride, and didn't want to stop going on it, but they were closing the park. And we stayed here till the park closed, which was big. I didn't think we would stay that long. Thought it'd be like two hours, and then people would melt down and attitudes would escalate and you would say, Chris, I'm tired of your behavior. We need to go. <laughs> we did go. Yeah. It was a fun afternoon. Uh -huh. So Fun little adventure. Right. So with that being said, uh, if you guys can come out to Silverwood, uh, I recommend it. It's pretty fun out here. Um, outside of that, thank you for watching and trekking with the tractors. What you gotta laugh at me for? I think I got it. We're good. We're good. Always good drinking my drinks. They did that one good. Except Sawyer drink out. Alright, let's get out of here.